These are pictures of the town of Usk, showing the town, the river, which has been flowing for centuries. The bridge and children's play area are prominent. It has a reputation for flowers, as in the main square. Also, there are pictures of activities in Monmouthshire Housing Residential Complex. <coughs> I live in Capendry Close, Abergavenny, and we have a small group of people who tend the gardens and keep the outside areas clean and tidy. We have recently had a grant from Monmouthshire Housing Association and bought garden tools to make the job easier. <coughs> a workman said last year that it is better than Linda Vista Gardens, and I think it is a super place to live. Hi, I live in Broadstone near Catbrook, just above Trellick. Well, it's about two miles above Trellick actually. There's only very small lanes as access to the hamlet. Um, it's a very pretty place and we enjoy living there com completely. All the neighbours get on very well. The gardens are all kept very pretty. The village green was donated by a local man and he also paid for the swings to go up. These are pictures of Chepstow, where I was born uh, 73 years ago. And uh, I can honestly say that um, I haven't moved only a hundred yards in 73 years. So the first picture is going to be of where I'm living now, Davis Court. The other pictures are places in Chepstow. There's a very nice picture of our chip shop. Um, there's a very nice picture of the church. There's also a very nice picture of where I live, which is, was built in about 1959. Uh, it's three stories and I live on the bottom floor. I also have a nice square, or we also have a nice square at the back, which we're currently developing. Hi, I live in Devorden, a small village outside of Chepstow, a small but friendly village. Our claim to fame is John Wesley gave a sermon when he was going around Wales. The Hood Memorial Hall always has something on at the weekend. Uh, you can access the woods very easily for nice walks. We have a small shop for essentials and a garage, once again for essentials. Our phone box has been turned into a defibrillator, which I don't think has yet been used. It's a very enjoyable village to live in.